Hey everybody, it's Michelle Marie. It's funny, yes, you can see my hair was redone today, or yesterday, and of course I'm at the Sip Kitchen this hot, steamy day. It will be up to about 27, 28 degrees Celsius today. Uh, it'll be steamy hot for the next, um, oh, I don't know. Um, looking at the forecast, it looks like it's going to be hot for the next uh, week anyway. Um, so it's going to probably start, temperatures will start. Uh, re dropping around um, maybe Wednesday. Um, so keep cool, drink plenty of liquids, and uh, have a good day. Spending some time, you know, outside, that's fine. Just make sure to uh, stay hydrated. Uh, of course, I wanted to let you know the eye report is brought to you by Can't See Eye Drops, which I'm the one products I've been using. Um, my right eye is now beginning to really show recovery. Um, that's all really I can tell you right now. I still got some fuzziness in my right eye. However, the things, the details are starting to come back. Uh, I'm very happy about that. Um, now, as I said, we use the uh, American flag here uh, as an eye chart. Now, I'm a little closer right now because my normal spot is um, is being um, used by someone else, so I can't really sit there right now. Um, but um, looking at the eye chart, I can kind of see um, the stars better on the flag. Uh, that's all I can tell you right now. My stigmatism, of course, is always going to be a problem no matter what you do. So, you know, you just have to take it with a grain of salt. Um, I'm still very much excited about the replacement corset I ordered and um, I'm waiting for that to come and uh, so I can begin my waist training uh, and eventually work myself down small enough that I can use the other corset. Um, like let me suggest it to me, she said keep the other corset um, because it's a it's a nice corset and uh, once you can get your waist down small enough to um, by waist training that you can get into it you know a little bit of exercise I've been doing a lot of walking lately um, and getting out a little more which is good because um, um, but my depression, seasonal affective disorder isn't really bothering me yet. I'm, of course, I've been taking the antidepressant from uh, Ostara, so actually the day before Ostara, around the, I think this year was around the, uh, Ostara's around the 20th, and I took that, I started taking that a day before. Uh, I could be wrong on that, I can double check the calendar if you really want. Um, but anyway, the point is, is that, um, Things look pretty good. Now the hair, as you can see, is really done. It is. Um, let me just put the camera this way. You can see it better. Um, it looks pretty good. It's got some, you know, nice details to it. Uh, we trimmed it up. We also made sure um, to remove any dead ends, and um, so it wouldn't be so bad. Because of the humidity, I put a little bit of hairspray in this morning uh, to help it hold up uh, to the humidity and the heat. Um, but normally, I wouldn't bother with the hairspray. Um, but I just decided to do it this morning because I had it, and I knew I was going to need it for the hold because, unfortunately, when it gets really hot and humid, uh, my hair kind of sort of kind of becomes untamed and you kind of get into a nasty surprise. Um, by the way, I'm going grocery shopping today with my case manager, and of course, we will be buying some groceries for the house. I decided to split the shopping list into two parts. One part is, or, or things I can't get in town, um, inexpensively, um, those things are on a list with her. The things that I can buy on my own in town at a reasonable price, I'm going to buy um, so that I can try to get things in. Um, coming up in the next few days, I'd like to have some waffles for breakfast. Uh, so I have frozen waffles on the list along with some maple pure 100% maple syrup uh, because I kind of would like to have some um, you know, frozen waffles um, on the weekend, and as well as of course cereals and things like that. So that's um, pretty much where I stand uh, in that. Now we've talked in a lot of times about different things on my channel, and of course we're going to continue to talk about different things. However, please remember that tomorrow night. Oh, actually, it's tonight. It's tonight. It's tonight at 11 p.m. Eastern Time. You gotta get your questions in for Ask Me Anything Friday to me and Lemmy, and we will definitely um, start reviewing the questions. So far, I have only one 
Maybe two. You got two questions. Actually, one's a statement, one's a question. Okay, one's a statement, one's a question. Okay, fine. We'll attack those two um, tomorrow. But right now, for the time being, is here's your deal. You get those questions in tonight. Um, by the means I've already mentioned in the last video, you can either email to me at B-I-C-H-E-L-A-3 at gmail.com or you can mail them to Lumi at L-U-M-I-F-I-N-I-S-T-R-A at gmail.com. You can also send them to us at Google Plus at plus M-I-C-H-E-L-E space M-A-R-I-E space D-S and dog A-L-E-N-E or you can send them to Lumi at plus L-U-M-I F-I-N-I-S-T-R-A and we will look at the questions. Um, please use the subject, ask us anything that helps us to um, try to keep the questions organized. Um, I do have Twitter but I don't really use it. It's a few set of questions in Twitter. There's a good chance that we'll never see them. So um, that's why I said it's in Google+. Plus. Um, I do use Facebook but I find Facebook to be a real pain in the butt. So I don't really use Facebook anymore. There's pretty much just to post the video com um, blogs. Um, so if you send it to us on Facebook, unfortunately, I am sorry to say, it probably will not be seen in time. So if you really want to make sure you guys ask us anything, please send it to those two addresses. If you want to send your questions to us by U.S. mail, um, which you can. I don't have a problem with that. Uh, just be aware that more than likely it will not be in tomorrow's, um, but it will be in next week's. You can you can U.S. mail your questions to Michelle Marie Delaney. That's M I C H E L E M A R I E D S and Dog A L E N E, one twelve Main Street, apartment number nine. That's one one two space M A I N Street S T R E E T, apartment nine. Winstead, W-I-N-S-T-E-D. The state is Connecticut or CT. The zip code is 06098. And of course, it's in the United States of America. And we will, of course, look at all the questions for, through the variety of methods. We will review them, research them if necessary to give you an honest answer. Questions can cover so anything and everything you can imagine from technology to spirituality to personal issues, whatever. Um, please ask your question as best we can in American English. Uh, I do have the ability to read Italian, but um, it's, it's easier to ask your questions in English, so there's no uh, loss in translation situation here. Um, however, let me be honest, I say, if you send me questions that are smutty, nasty, and downright raunchy, uh, your questions will more likely be promptly ignored. If you're are you, you and many others ask the same question, I'm going to answer it one time only. I'll give your name and I'll say et all at the end, meaning that more than one person's asked it. So it means I ourselves uh, a constant problem of having the same question being asked multiple times because I can't answer 4,000 questions if they're all the same about, you know, whatever topic. So just try to keep that in mind. And don't be afraid that I'm not going to answer your question. Uh, we will do our best to answer it. If we don't get to them this week, we will get to them next week. And we will do our best to answer everything we can in a timely manner. Remember, the videos on the main YouTube channel can be as long as necessary. So if it takes five hours, uh, well, maybe not if it takes five hours, but maybe if it takes an hour and a half to two hours to answer the questions, we'll take one and a half to two hours to answer the questions. That's what you want. That's what you need. That's what we'll do. Okay? That's a simple fact. However, because it is hot, we'll be using the old studio. Um, is, at least that room has an air conditioner, and it will be easier to work in there until uh, next week. Right now, we just closed the other studio for the summer, and we will be in the old studio for now until um, autumn, late autumn. When it gets cold enough, then we'll go ahead and transition back to the uh, multimedia studio, which right now I have to admit looks like a uh, pigsty. I mean, it's got so much stuff in there right now. It's very hard to work in there anyway. Uh, so we got to clean that room up. Yeah, we do. Um, so, okay, guys, that's all I wanted to say for now. But again, you want to do it? Okay. Don't forget to like or dislike. Share with everybody. Friends, enemies, the neighbor's dog, I don't care. Subscribe if you have not already done so. And please, leave us your 
questions for this video in the videos or in the comment section below. And if it's an Ask Us Anything question, like Michelle said, please email us, Google Plus them, and then we will get them. And then we can be sure to answer them in a timely manner. Um, that's the easiest way to do it. If you're going to ask us anything questions in this video, um, it might get a little confusing. And like, but if they're generic enough, we will see and we will um, compile them in. Great. Okay, guys, that's it for now. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, guys.